Happy Tuesday, everybody. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if it's your first time here. If it is your first time here, feel free to hit that red subscribe button down below so you catch every video I post. That's every week. Today's video is all about time management. And to kind of keep that on trend, I'm gonna try and keep this super short because your time is pretty valuable, that's why you're watching this video in the first place. So jumping right in, I'm gonna share three tips with you guys. Tip number one, silence your devices. Everybody's got devices, whether it's their cell phone, a tablet, a computer, we're all connected somehow. It just seems to be a thing at this point. Silence it. Turn it off if you want. You don't need it pestering you all the time. That email, that Facebook update, it'll wait. Tip number two, schedule everything. If it's not in the schedule, it will not get done. Keep in mind, you need time to sleep, you need time to eat, you will need time to relax and have fun. So schedule those things in. Because if you forget, all of a sudden your schedule's thrown off. Which brings me to my last tip. Tip number three is be realistic and not optimistic when you're scheduling. If you know you're not a morning person, don't be optimistic and think that you're gonna perform at top speed first thing in the morning. You're not going to. So rather than do that, schedule an appropriate amount of time for you to get your tasks done and maybe throw yourself a bone and do an easier task first thing in the morning while you're waking up and a harder task later in the morning once you've gotten going. Know how long it takes you to do stuff. Time it if you have to, but be realistic when you're making your schedule. Don't assume you're Wonder Woman. You can't magically make three hours worth of work, only take one. Maybe if you're efficient, you'll get it down to two, but you won't do that on your first go around. If you undersell how much time you're gonna need, all of a sudden your entire schedule is backed up. It is better to give yourself a little bit of extra time and know that you can immediately start on the next task or give yourself a five minute window where you can just relax than it is to assume you can do it faster than you actually can and be playing catch up for the rest of the day. So hopefully these tips helped you. If you have others, leave them down below. I'd love to see them. And I'll see you guys all next week. Bye.